Hello guys, it's Laura and you're watching Laura X Annie and I am back finally with a new video. Um, as you can see, the background has changed a lot since my last video. Um, yeah, I'm no longer standing in front of my bookcase. I'm now sitting down at a desk. Mm. So if you guys don't know, Halloween and autumn is my favourite time of year because I love Halloween. I love the fact my birthday's in autumn, I love the way the leaves change and the, the feel of autumn and also bonfire night I do love. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd do a bit of a haul for you guys to start us back. Um, and through the haul I have loads of Halloween decorations so I thought I would just show you them in me putting them up in my room. So let's get into this. First of all, let's start with this little basket of goodies. A lot of these still have the price on because I literally just bought them, so that's why. So first things first, we have this, which is a lovely glitter skeleton from Asda at a pound. Um, this skeleton is named Roger, and I'll explain in a bit why his name is Roger, but this is Roger, and I have no clue where I'm going to put him yet, but I'm sure you will see in a bit where he's going to go. Next up, we have some skull lights which were four pounds from Asda. Um, these are battery operated, I really hope we have the batteries for these, but these are just going to go behind my bed um, on the bed frame because I think it's going to look really cool. Uh, next up we have some treats. We have the Smarty Scaries which are the, um, I think they're just the orange and brown ones. Orange Smarties are my favourite and having them in a bag I might use these in the baking video that you guys are going to see very soon um, or I might just eat them for myself. I have yet to decide. Next up, definitely for the baking video, is these. These are 75 creepy paper cases and I'm sure these were 150. Hold that thought. They're actually 120. These are 120 uh, from Asda and there's 75 in them. I do not need 75 but they will be good to keep because paper cases keep. Next thing I have is this. It is two pounds and it is a leering light up skull. Um, and it lights up red. Let's pull this out and then turn it on. See, it's red eyes. So there's that, which is just a normal skull, but it lights up red. Nice. Next up, I have two little glitter pumpkins. One is black, one is silver. Um, and they were a pound each. So they can just go in my bookcase. They will look nice. And finally for this box of goodies, I have something that is not from Asda but it's from Primark and it's 2 50 and it is uh, nails with adhesive, Fright Club, get your freak on, candy skull. But I would say they are very Nightmare Before Christmas inspired because they have like Jack Skellington. And so yeah, I've got them for, I guess, Halloween time. Next up we have a whole big Asda bag. It holds a lot of the bigger stuff. First of all, we have this pumpkin where the, I think the tag just came off. This was three pounds, so it's just a orange glitter pumpkin, um, as you do. Next up, I think this was two pounds, yep. Yeah. It is a um, creepy skull tree. Um, I'm gonna use it for the baking videos, but it's quite cool. It just, it has like old London newspaper and a skull, so it makes me think of Jack Ripper. So um, yeah, we have that. Uh, next up, we have, Tim Burton's The Nightmare Before Christmas. This was three pounds from Asda. Um, I don't have The Nightmare Before Christmas. I used to have it, but I think I threw it out and it's my favorite film of all time. So I thought I'd get that. Uh, next up, we have something that has got nothing to do with Halloween, but I wanted it. It is the magazine Cosmo and it is the Lily Allen and I've just realized it matches my walls. It's pink. I love it very much, so yes. And finally for this bag, I have a very special person. This is Padfoot. It is literally, no joke, it's head moves. It is a literal dog skeleton. And this was six pounds. It's, it's a movable skeleton. It's So this is Padfoot and the ske glitter skeleton is Roger. Because, so when I sent a photo of my trolley into the group chat, Sam instantly picked up on this and was like, oh my god, what's his name? And I was like, I haven't named him yet. And uh, Kira instantly said, Roger. 
and uh, then they had a bit of a conversation over how Roger is a farmer's name and not a name for a sausage dog and so I eventually said that this is Padfoot and the skeleton is Roger because Roger is fabulous. So key this am, um, here's Padfoot and Liss just because you were at work at this point. Padfoot. Next up, this isn't Halloweeny, but it is Halloweeny because I'm going to put it out. But it is this beautiful box, and what is inside, you may ask? It is, of course, Draco Malfoy's wand. I got this from the Platform 9 and 3 quarters shop uh, in London in King's Cross uh, about a, over a year ago. So I thought. I'll bring this back out because I've had my room redone so I haven't done it. We have a box of two things from ASOS which just came. First up is a tassel garland, black bats with black and purple iridescent tassels um, and it's bunting and I thought very spooky bunting for this time of year but also quite classy. And we have um, Harry Potter mule slippers size small to medium 7 to 9 and uh, these might be a tiny bit too big for me because they are men's but they should fit. Uh, so yeah, Slytherin, cause it's my house. I hope you guys enjoyed this little haul. There wasn't much, but I hope you enjoyed watching me put them up. Um, I uh, will be filming a lot more videos now. Um, kind of gonna do some makeup looks, or at least try. Try being the operative word, because I'm not very good at makeup. So I will try. Uh, I'll also do a baking video I'm gonna make from the lovely Zoella's Cordially Invited, her new book. She has um, some pumpkins, so I'm going to make some lovely pumpkin treats, Rice Krispie treats, um, and also put my own spin in it, which I'm very excited to do. Um, and I will be vlogging a lot more, so look out for vlogs on this channel, uh, specifically around Christmas time. There will be a lot more. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys very soon with another video. Bye! Okay, so a little bit of housekeeping. I will try and link everything in the down bar from the haul. Also, a uh, Twitter handle has changed. It's now at Hamlet's Alter Ego. So please do go follow me if you aren't. And in about a second, you're going to see me talking to the dog. It's not talking to the dog. I was uh, shouting down to mum saying I was about to take my dog a walk. And also, I have a red bubble now. If you want to see any of my stuff, buy any of my stuff, you are more than welcome to. It's nothing to do with the YouTube, just... I like to draw. See ya, boy!